Cool things you can do in Canva, part seven. Create and present your online course slides. Head to canva.com or open the Canva app. And from here, you are going to create course slides. So I'm just finding the ones that I have. And if you are in my online course, your first online course in 60 days, you get these templates to use to easily create your slides for your online course. So from here, you can see I have all of my slides already created. And like I said, you can get these templates too. But what I wanna show you in this video is how to actually share these slides to actually present these slides. So you can click on present or you can click on share. So if you click on present, there is present full screen, presenter view, present and record, okay? So presenter view is basically how you see the slides if you're presenting them live in like a live coaching call over Zoom or in Kajabi, okay? So your presenter window looks like this. You have the slides, you have the slides on the bottom and on the right-hand side, you have your actual notes. So these can be literally your presentation script and this is what you are seeing, but your audience is only seeing just the slide, which is really cool. The only downside to this here is that you actually need two computers or two pieces of tech to present it this way because you cannot have both screens running at once. Next up is how to present and record. So this is how you would pre-record your slides to load into your online course. So into Thinkific, right? So you have the slides, you want to add a voiceover so you can have present and record and you have two options. You have a way of just doing a voiceover or you can actually add yourself in a video. Okay. So let's check this out. So here I already had one pre-recorded. So you can see in that bottom left-hand corner, there's that little circle and I am in there. Okay. But I am going to just delete this one and we're going to start a fresh one so I can show you how it's done. So you're going to click on go to recording studio and this is going to take you right here. And here you can choose if you want to add the photo of yourself with your FaceTime camera. I guess it depends on what you're using or you can have no camera and then it'll just be your voiceover. So you get to choose which one. Let's go with a video for this round so you can see. So you get to start recording. It counts down and there I am in the bottom left hand corner. And now I have full presenter view, right? Because we're recording this, but all that's going to be recorded is that slide with me in the bottom left hand corner but i get to see what's coming next i get to see all of my notes so it's a super easy way to present this to then download it and then put it in your online course right in think of it. So when you're done recording all your slides, you're going to hit end recording. You can also always hit pause if something comes up or you need a sip of water or whatever. So end recording, and then it's going to upload your recording into Canva. And then like I showed you before, how we already had one of me saved, it's going to be saved there. So you're going to save and exit. So there it is. So you can hit download it and then save it to your computer and then if you want to re-record it, you have to delete it or you can have it saved in Canva forever. You can also just create a public view link that you can share, which will take them right to this video in Canva if you want to share your slides and presentation that way. But the best way is to download it and load it into Thinkific and have a set dashboard for your students to watch their online course. Once you hit download, this is what the video is going to look like. So you have the slides, you have the little circle video of yourself presenting it down in the left hand corner, and it's going to go through the slides as you recorded it with your voiceover on top of it. And it's ready to present and share with your students. That's it for this week's cool things you can do in Canva. Please hit like and subscribe. I put out new videos twice a week. I'll see you then.